How's it going everybody? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video is Seasons Tackle unboxing of the July Smallmouth Bass Box. I am not sponsored. This is not a sponsored video. Let's go ahead and jump in. Inside of the box here, we've got a thank you card, business card for the owner like normal, couple stickers, Seasons Tackle. I think this is their summer logo. And we've got Get to Tackle sticker. That is a big sticker. Camo Lures, looks like we've got a black and a yellow haired jig. Another one of these, I like these. These are great for um, obviously smallmouth bass since this is a smallmouth bass box. But we've got Stachios Custom Jigs. Looks like a green head, black silver. This is not like hair, but it's like the plasticky um, fibers. On the tip of the jig, it's got plastic covering it, so that'll have to come off in order to make this hook worthwhile. Otherwise, that's not gonna puncture very much, unless that's intentional. Anyways, green-headed jig, really nice. We've got Larry's Walleye Tackle, like a rip and wrap hard bait. Nice coloring on it. I like the blue fleck in it. it does have rattle. Love my rattle baits. Northern Lights Tackle. Look at this thing. Uh, we've got a blade on the back of the jig. Nice big hook on it. And bright colors. That'd be nice to use. We've got JH Custom Bait. Big hard bait. Look at the coloring on that. That orange and black. That is a nice looking hard bait. And it's got three treble hooks on it. Look at that. I'm excited to use this. Midwest Warriors Bait and Tackle. I'm gonna have to open this one because you can't really tell. Oh, I see, I would have totally missed this. But we've got green headed jig, lots of flu flu on it, nice treble hook, and a silver spinner paddle thing. And we've got more Billy Rub Crawfish. Same thing I got last time, I haven't tried it out yet. Northern Lights Tackle. We got, this is a hard bait, it is not soft at all, but this is hard. Minnow look to it, big hook on the back, and it's got a piece of metal coming out of the top. Oh, that's probably to make it weedless. I've never seen a bait like that style before. That is interesting. Cool. I guess the weeds hit it and they brush over the hook. I've seen the fiber type where there's a bunch of harder fibers, but this is an actual wire. So that's kind of cool. We'll see how well it works. Some plastics here, 1492 company. It looks like we've got five yellow and black paddle tails. More plastics, green pumpkin, three and a half inch four pack. Ooh, these are tubes. These will be nice. I've seen a lot of videos online using this type of thing. I'm excited to try them out. Green pumpkin supposedly good for smallmouth, I guess. Premier Custom Tackle Co. Looks like we've got a little uh, bait with some beads on it, red treble hook, and a blade. Kind of a, a drop and jig, it looks like. We got another one of these from Northern Lights Tackle. A little bit different color. This was the other one that we had gotten from them. So these two together, orange and black. I love the orange and black. Uh, this one's a little bit different hook style though. You've got the the jig head and then it looks like the hook is hooked directly up to the wire on it rather than a jig head. Midwest Warriors bait and tackle. Another jig with bait, exact same it looks like, just different colors than this one that we had looked at. Just a pink black and purple option. Some plastics, Billy Rub Baits. I know I got these last month in the Father's Day box. Fish don't eat salad. Northern Lights Tackle, here's another big jig head hook, heavy duty hook here, pink and white, really nice. Cranky Baits, I know I got one of these in the Father's Day box that I opened last month. Uh, I haven't gotten a chance to get out since I got this one, uh, but I'm excited to try it. It's a little sunfish size. It's a little fat guy. It's got a rattle in it. Really cool. Two treble hooks. Should be fun to use. Another hard crankbait here. Uh, this one's translucent, so you can kind of see through it. It definitely has a rattle in it. Big front bill. Two treble hooks. 
Really nice paint. Then we've got Midwest Warriors Bait and Tackle again. Big fat uh, purple and pink square bill. Two big, big red treble hooks on this guy. 1492 Company. Another square bill crank bait. Two red treble hooks. This one's got, it's you can kind of see through it. You can see the rattle in it. It's got silver specks on the top of it. And it's got green and gold in the coloring on it. And it's got really cool googly kind of reflective eyes on it. Really cool. Midwest Warriors Bait and Tackle again. They are the featured partner of this box. You can definitely tell. It's brown and black, white bottom, two red treble hooks, square bill. Larry's Walleye Tackle. We've got a hard bait, three treble hooks on this guy. It's got a small little bill on it, uh, translucent. It has beads in it. It's got like those perch stripes on it. I'm not sure um, what exactly the coloring is called on this one, but I like the eye on this one as well. Nice bait. And then last but not least, Camo Lures. These are the heavier heads on these. Great assortment here. I'm looking forward to use these out on the lake. Thanks for watching, and until next time, take it easy.